Welcome back to the University of Akron First Energy Stadium. Cub Cadet Field, 1-0. Stanford leading Akron at halftime. Let's check in with Chad Welker. Thanks, Dave. Here with John McDonald from the Student Wellness Center here at the University of Akron. And, John, uh, first of all, you're in your 16th fall. Uh, tell me how uh, it's been here being the director of the Student Wellness Center here at the University of Akron. Uh, this is a great place to be. It's an awesome opportunity for our students to come in to be able to get a workout in, to be able to get great student employment and job opportunities, to get certifications, to be developed as students, but to really work on the holistic wellness of what they need to be able to you know, remain healthy and create a healthy lifestyle at this point in their lives. Share with me a little bit about the space here at the rec center. You got some weight rooms, you got some climbing wall. Just share with me what uh, students and even members of the community will see when they come to this building. Absolutely. I think it's amazing what we have that most people might not know about. So within our facility, over 200 pieces of strength and cardio equipment, 53-foot climbing wall, two pools, leisure pool, includes a 30-person hot tub, spa, place to hang out, lazy river, great place to be after a workout. We've got our competition pool, Olympic pool, that gets set up for short and long course. Within the aquatics program, we do swim lessons. So then throughout the gym, we've got three different wood courts, two multi-purpose courts. So those are like a rubber type floor that's set up. We can do a lot of different events and sports in that space. Uh, in addition to our outdoor adventure program. So outdoor offers, uh, the, not only in addition to the climbing wall, and they also do outdoor trips, equipment rental. So if you wanted to take your own trip, come on in, rent some equipment, take it out, head out there and, and enjoy what we have to offer here in the local area. Uh, and then our club sports, 30 different club sport teams. And intramural sports, we offer 10 to 15 intramural sports per semester. So if you're a student, there's a lot of things that you can be involved with for sure. But how about the community side? How can the community uh, and people in the local area get to the rec center and be a part of the action here? Uh, that's a great question. One of the things that we're looking to grow is our community out outreach and community engagement. And that includes community memberships. So we offer memberships to students, to, to faculty and staff here on campus to alumni, but we also offer it to the community. So our community membership can be as low as $28 a month, which is a great rate for all the amenities that we have. You mentioned the rubber courts of basketball uh, earlier and what you have here. That's also a foot, futsal court as well. Tell me how big futsal, since we're debuting this uh, interview during the Stanford match, tell us how big that's come here at Akron. Absolutely, so futsal is five on five indoor soccer. So we have futsal on our schedule for open recreation. We also have it as intramurals, and then we also have soccer club sports, both men's and women's. So a lot of opportunity for students outside of athletics to engage in soccer. So they can come in, their court's set up, they're playing five on five, be able to just drop in recreation, come on in and, and do pick up and get on a team, join some friends and play futsal. And then lastly, what is the relationship that the Student at, uh, Wellness Center uh, has with the athletic department? We work hand in hand with athletics, so they're over here utilizing our spaces at times. We have our intramural sports and club sport teams out on athletic fields. So it's just such an amazing opportunity to have that engagement and that good relationship with athletics that students get an opportunity to come out and play. You know, think about a, a student gets to now play flag football in the stadium. I mean, how cool is that?